Imagine what can happen to you. You are living in the, during the time of the ministry of the Holy Spirit. What can the Holy Spirit do in your life when he was doing such wonders when he was beginning the ministry of the Holy Spirit? Kabanga ukuthi ungayenza kalani empilweni yakho uphila ngesikhathi lapho umoyo ongcwele ungaphakathi kithi. People they must look at you and say what happened to this one? Abantu kumele babheke kuwe bathi kwenzeka leni kulo muntu. Wondering what the Bamangele ukuthi kwenza kalani kuwe. Yes, this is the Holy Spirit. Lo umoyo ongcwele. This what the spirit of God does in you. Umoyo ongcwele wenza lokho empilweni yakho. People they must look at you and they say, "Wow, what is this? What we are seeing?" Abantu kumele babheke kuwe bathi, "Oh, yini lokho sikubonana." Sickness they must never come next to you. Ukugula kufanele kungeze eceleni kwakho. Spirit must no longer come close. Umoyo ongcwele fanele ungeze eduzane kwakho. They were speaking and things were happening. Bebe kuluma izinto zenzeka. In such a way that the Bible says even people that were getting healed by only touching the shadow of Peter, it was just the beginning. It was just the beginning of the ministry. Imagine now. Kabanga manje. You are living in the era of the Holy Spirit. Zipila ngesikati somoyo inwe. Isi into kumele zenze kempilwe nzako. Isi into esi ningi zenze kempilwe niyako. He must move mightily in you. Fanele ahambe empilwe niyako. He must never just touch you but move. He must move mightily. New things must start to happen in your life. New things must start to happen in your life. This is how powerful the Holy Spirit of God is. The Spirit of God in us. He must touch you also. You want to be touched. Be touched. We need him. See I'm doing. We need the spirit of God inside of us. Sitinga umoya kwankulunkulu ngaphakathi kithi. He must fill us. Fanela sigcwalise. I believe we can do better than the apostles. Ngiyathemba ngiyakholwa ukuthi singayenza kangcono kuna ma apostles. I'm saying again the ministry of the Holy Spirit was just starting. Ngithi eh inkonzo yomoyo ingcwele beqala. It was just starting. But great things happened. Be filled. More of the spirit in you. Be filled. Be filled. This is the turn around of your life now. Spirit of God for his ministry. Umoyo ingwele. Ka, be filled. Kwaliswa. Live. Yeah. She's drunk. Move away from her. Don't touch her. Ngambambi. Don't touch her. Live. 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 Miyegele ni ngambambi. She's receiving. Uyamugela. She's drunk with the Holy Spirit now. Utagiwe moyo ingwele. We must be filled. The world must see. When they look at you, they must see no this person is extraordinary. We must be extraordinary people. That is why the Bible, when it talks about us, it says we are peculiar people. Peculiar people, you are a different person. Singabantu abanga choile kwa ba special. Why must you be like the people in the world? You must be, you must be filled. Kwa ni kwa liswe. You must be filled also. Kwa liswa. You must be filled also. Kwa liswa. Receive him. Kwa liswa. Receive him. Yamgela. Kwa more of him in you. Shata ra ba 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 ba. Shake keke ra ba 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 ba. Re 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 ba 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 ba. More of him. More of him. More of him. Receive him. This is the feeling of the Holy Spirit. You start to pray in tongues. Speak in tongues. What you speak, it must happen. 
What it, you rebuke, it must listen to you. Pray for the feeling change. Pray for the feeling. Upon me. Come down. Come down. Come down. We need the Holy Spirit. I'm telling you, you will never be the same again. Call on him to fill you. Call on him. Call on him. Call on him to fill you. 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 The power of the Holy Spirit. The power of the Holy Spirit. Oh. you not now he's touching you 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 be filled be filled be filled be filled all over your body be filled all over your body be filled be filled be filled you need the Holy Spirit be filled be filled be filled be filled all over your body. The power of God. The Holy Spirit 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 of God. He's touching you. All over you. The Holy Spirit of God. The power of God. Come out. out. Receive the power of God. The move of the Holy Spirit. The move of the Holy Spirit in you. Spirit of God in abundance in your life. The power to bring change in you. This is the power which brings transformation. It is bringing victory in you. God, receive it. Pray church, pray church, pray church. You need this power inside of you. You need this power inside of you. You need this power inside of you. You need this power. You need this power. You need the power of the Holy Ghost. That's the power of the Holy Spirit moving in you. The power to effect change in you. The power to bring transformation. Power to make you a new person. The power to make you to do the impossible. This is the power which is coming upon you, church. Pray for it, church. Pray for it. Pray for it. Pray for that power. Pray for it. In the name of Jesus. 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 I don't want ashes without the Holy Spirit. You get. We must be filled. You need more. God, I must, you must receive more. You are not enough. Take, take, take it. You need more. God, take it. God, receive it. Worshippers must be filled with the Holy Spirit. To make you like a child in the presence of God. This is how powerful the Holy Spirit of God is. Take him in the name of Jesus Christ. Come on, receive him, church. Receive him, pray. Receive him, receive him, receive him, receive him. Receive him, receive him. This is the Holy Spirit for your life. The Holy Spirit for your house. The Holy Spirit for your ministry. The Holy Spirit for your future. Holy Spirit to excel in your business. Holy Spirit to excel at your work. Holy Spirit to excel in your house. People that will be wondering what is happening with this person. It will be the Spirit of God working in you. It will make you to do things which other people cannot do. Pray for him. Receive him. Receive him. Receive him. Receive him. The spirit of change. Receive him. Receive the Holy Spirit. Receive the Holy Spirit. Take him. 
Take it. He's upon you. In abundance. Upon your ministry. Worshipper. Be filled. Be filled, worshipper. Come. Worshipper, the spirit of God must move in you. God is changing your ministry. This is the spirit of elevation. It's the spirit of elevation in you now. Revival in your life. 